All right, so we got Pokimane right here. Hello! <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen of the YouTube citizens, y'all know who this is. It's your boy True and today's day is Friday, September the 20th. We are at TwitchCon. Yes, your boy is doing it big. We are live at TwitchCon. So let's take a look at the game real quick. We got a Team Go Rocket Balloon right here. What? Oh, that's a Galarian Pony tie. We just had that community today, but can't go wrong with getting those shinies. And then we got to make you to check. Now, there's no... TwitchCon exclusive event going on in the game. Uh, you know, obviously there's a bunch of Pokestops here and some spawns are here as well. I'm not sure any of these spawns or Pokestops rather are like exclusive to TwitchCon. I think they just here naturally. So that's what's going on right now. So yeah, it is TwitchCon. This is my first time meeting or being here at TwitchCon. So we got some stuff that we need to do because the um, Psychic Spectacular event is going on right now. So we're going to collect these challenges right here. I already completed them, you know, capture certain Pokemon, evolve certain Pokemon. Let's see what this one is real quick. So we got 5,000 XP and an encounter with uh, Hatina, how you pronounce the joint. This is the new one. Yo, I actually got a 96% idea of one of these, which is crazy. And I had to use some rare candies because I had over 700 in my item space. I need you to stop moving. And my item space is full. So I had to use up some rare candies on this Pokemon, so I can evolve one anytime I want. So actually, I'm gonna do that in this video. So that's what's gonna go on here. So I need to capture some more fairy types, because we got the challenge that we need to fill out as well, outside the collection challenge. And then, let's see. Oh, you know what, I didn't check this yet. That is not shiny. So far, I have not gotten a single shiny since I arrived here in San Diego, which was yesterday. And also, the new Dynamax Raid Balls, Beldum is here. I took one on. It's extremely difficult, but you can solo it. You can solo it. You don't have to power up any Pokemon or anything like that. So yeah, there you go with that. We'll get more on that in a second as well. All right, let's claim this one. And let's see what we got going on here. A thousand does. And an encounter with another Hattie. Now, how you pronounce that joint? Which is, we can't be shiny at the moment. So there's that. We're going to go ahead and I don't know why I use a pineapple on it, but whatever. We got a connection with the Great Ball on the Pokeball. And this should be a catch. And it is a catch. All right, so yeah, we got TwitchCon going on right now. IVs are crap, and you know what? Let's check this. That is not shiny. So yeah, TwitchCon, cosplayers, a lot of streamers all over the place. So yeah, let's get into it. Let's go. Man, it's been an eventful twist con so far. I showed up at a wrestling panel, chatted up with the leaders of the Black Guild, and now we are back in Pogo. So I did mention that we got some stuff to claim. So we got the daily Pokecoin Bounty Part 1 ticket. I still gotta walk 50 more kilometers, but I should be able to get that done before Twitch Con. Well, really, before I leave San Francisco. So I should get that done before then. But we got this: the Psychic Spectacular 2024 Premium Time Research that would be over in less than two days. So I need to capture 16 more Psychic or Fairy types. So we need to do that as well. Over here, we got the Gala Calling. So yeah, we need to claim this stuff. We got 2,000 XP, 1,000 dust, 50 Score Bunny candies, and three rare candies. And we're gonna get 2,000 more XP and an encounter with a Rulu that could have been shiny, but it is not shiny, boo his his all right so there you go with that we're going to quick catch that now oh guys willow where's the skip button <laughs> i need that skip button all right so let's see collect mp from 10 power spots and spin okay that one gonna be easy spin 25 puck stops of gems and then explore five kilometers that's gonna be easy as well so far no shinies or anything spectacular like that let's see do we have any hundos though because i did have some eggs nope no new hundos or anything like that I had some eggs recently. I don't know where they all at. Oh yeah, we got the Jane Ball right here. IVs are bland. 
We got a Gumi, which is bland, and a Carbank, which is also bland. So there's that, but I'm about to do what I promised y'all at the beginning. Let me find it real quick. It's right here. We got, really, you're gonna move to the egg section. This right here, we got a 96% IV Latina right here, extra large. We're going to evolve it all the way up to its final form. So let's see what's going on right here. On my left, we got like a bunch of Floma Town members. So remember, I am a part of Floma Town. So yeah, we got that going on all to my left over here. Y'all can't see them, but they there. So there's that. All right, let's see. So yeah, Pokedex entry right here. Look at this thing right here. We got the hat trim right here. And now we're about to evolve it all the way to the tippy top right here. Don't judge me. But yeah, anywho, let's see how this looks. And well, we know how this looks. If you've seen the pictures, you play some of the newer games. But yes, there it is right there. I actually like this Pokemon, the Hatri um, Hatterini. I actually like this. It's actually not bad. It's not bad at all. I cannot wait for the shiny to pop up in the game. That's going to be some exciting stuff. So there it is. 96% IV. It's not useful for anything at the moment, but it's a 96 percenter. So I can't really complain that much. All right, so we got all that. I need to capture some more psychotypes. So yeah, let's go. All right, so it is a new day. Yes, it is. It is Saturday, September the 21st. All right, so we are back at TwitchCon and we got a few checks to do. This Delosa is not shiny. I still need about two more of those to complete the family. Inke is right there, not shiny. I already checked this one already. That is not shiny. And then there's a Beldum Dynaray nearby. I cannot reach it. In my fact, it's right there. I cannot reach it unless I get really close to it, I guess. I don't know what's up with that. But anywho, we have completed a time research. We're talking about the date. No, not that one. The Psychic Spectacular Premium Time Research. We did complete that. So we're going to claim our items. We're going to get one star piece. One regular incubator. Oh my gosh, there's a bunch of checks to do. Let's see what this first one is. It's a Moelu, not shiny. I'm not concerned with that. That should have been the quick catch glitch, but I messed that up for some odd reason. Oh, he kicked out too. That's that's beautiful. All right, so now we got that. He's still kicking out. Why are you kicking out? Stay in the Pokeball. You are not important. Stay in the Pokeball. All right, that should be a catch. Thank you. Now let's move on to the next check, which would be, let's see what this one is. Another Moray Lou. Oh, 420 CP. You are so going to be transferred. All right, so there you go with that. And then let's see. We got this one right here. Another Moray Lou. Yep, another Moray Lou. 429 CP. So we got that in the books. And then we got four more things to check. Another Moray Lou. 415 CP. That one is terrible. So that's a quick catch. And then we got this one right here. Another Moray Lou. Not shiny. None of these are shiny. But again, I already got this shiny family completed, so I'm not really concerned with it. But still, though, with all these checks, you would think I would get at least one. Oh, okay. A Hatina at the end. I didn't expect that. Okay. And we're going to go ahead. And you saw this early in the video. I did evolve my Hatina all the way to its final evolution. Okay, you need to stop moving. But yeah, I already evolved one of these to the final evolution. The 96% IV one. That's the one I evolved. In case y'all forgot, within a matter of minutes. All right, here we go. One super incubator, 15,000 XP, and encounter with another Hatina. And of course, that cannot be shiny at this moment in time. So we're gonna go ahead and quick catch this. And is there another page to that? I don't think so. So I'm gonna say no, but we still got another research to do. The daily Pokecoin bounty part one ticket. I need three more kilometers to get that done. And then over here, we need uh to do that as well i'm not sure if i'll be able to get the galar calling joint done this weekend but we'll try our best we'll try our best stay tuned So I'm leaving TwitchCon for the day because we got the block party to get ready for, which is literally behind the camera, actually. But we got to 
We got to, oh, so apparently we can't go that way. So we gotta go another way. So anywho, we need to claim some stuff real quick as I try to make my way back to the Airbnb. So let's see, we got to claim this, 200 Poke Coins, 2,500 XP, 2,500 more XP, even more XP, and even more XP, and then we're gonna move on to the dust. So we're talking about 2,500 there, 2,500, 2,500, and one more 2,500 right there. All right, and then we're gonna get 50,000 XP, 50,000 dust, and that's it, actually. I believe that's it. So we completed that, that's what's up, and I have not done anything regarding the whole get the power spots. I have not been either close to it or I've rarely been checking. So we're gonna make our way back to the Airbnb. Oh, Shadow Raid is out. And then I think, it, I don't remember what it is, but we're gonna make our way back to the Airbnb as the baseball game, we're near the Padre Stadium, so the baseball game is on right now. But anyway, we're gonna make our way back to the Airbnb and I'm gonna get ready to go to this block party. So yeah, I'll see y'all on the next day. Be contaminated with emotion and focus and that and my focus cannot be broken. I'm hoping you get the message. Show my team is just reckless. Examine their mistakes and I'm hoping you can correct them. Cause they are not an option. Get it popping. Expedience. If you can't believe it, it's even that we be feeling it. Trust me. The punishment. Worse than a reprimand. Yeah. Get it right the first time. We don't got a chance. Yo, attack. Attack. Enemy attack. We are highly advanced and select us a match. Attack. Attack. Enemy attack. It's the third and final day of TwitchCon and we got the research event that just started two minutes ago. So the first thing we need to do, we need to clear out all of these uh, field research hats. I had a brain fart for a second, except for that one. I want those Poké Coins. All right, so we're going to spin this Poké Stop right here and then we're going to spin this one right here. And I did not mean to click on the meow. That meow needs to get out of here. And then we're going to do this right here. There we go. And is that, oh, that's two meows right there. All right, so let's see what we got to do here. Earn three hearts with your buddy and use three nanas for I catch your Pokemon. Okay, so we're going to use three nanas real quick. And hopefully we can get the uh, A-Palm real quick. Assuming that it's don't, where well, it shouldn't be really be moving. It's because I use a nanas on it. So basically, Hopefully I'm doing this right. I may have to look at the special recess, so that's one. And then we also got put on a incense of some kind. We got put on an incense. All right, we got the nice throw on it, so that's number two. And then we're gonna use one more. And then, bam, okay, we caught the me, uh, A-Palm. I about to say Meow because there was two Meows next to me. Interesting PvP IVs, but they're not good in PvP. Oh, you know what? We should have uh, tried to capture the Venom off. I know that one would not stay in the Pokeball. And boom, we got the great throw. And then this should be, I don't care if this is a catch or not. I just want, and it is a catch, but I just want to complete the field research. So yeah, TwitchCon, I'm exploring the rest of it. I didn't really get a good chance to explore a lot of it the first two days, because there so, there's so much going on here, man. There's so much to do here. So let's see what this is. <clears throat> it's Oranguru, which is not shiny, which is not what I want. That is not what I want. We want the Persimian. We want shiny Persimian. It's now in the game. So that's the main focus that we want right here. There's other shinies that we want that are not in field research, but the main one that we want is Persimmon. Oh my gosh, that's a 96 percenter. Are you serious? That's a 96 percent IV. Now let me check on the special, is there special research? No. And then how about this? Okay, we do got a Persimmon premium time research and an Oranguru premium time research. So we need to complete 15 of these things. Hopefully the Pokestops reset. That would be beautiful. And then let's see, we need to power Pokemon three times, so let's get that out the way real quick. And I already know exactly what Pokemon I'm going to power up. Um, oh, wait a minute, it should be a R. There it is. And it's either this one, no, not this one, it's this one. Look at those IVs. And then we're gonna do this. Two, three. 
and then boom, we completed that right there. And I'm not, let's see if that counts towards that. Let's see. So let's see. Yes, it is. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, so we're gonna get some more Pokestops, stops, and we're gonna try to find these shinies here at TwitchCon. Let's go. Here we go, y'all. We all know. Awesome to see you. All right, everybody. You all have smart devices. So this is what I need. I need you all to take out your smart devices. Type in Mega Ran on your Twitch. And give that boy a follow. Give that boy a sub. Show your love. <laughs> I appreciate it so much. All right. And please, if you could, make some noise. Throw in the keys for our Kodaks. And the man that makes it all go. Give the drummer sub. So, I'm at Twitch Rivals watching this ultimate challenge go down. We got it. We got the shiny Persimmon. I cannot believe we got it so easily. The shiny Persimmon right here. I can't believe it. So, we still got more shinies to get, but we got it right here. I can't believe it. So, yeah, that's what's up. That's what's up. We got the new shiny. The players are ready. You may begin in five, four, three, two, one. So, yeah, we're going to look for some more. Stay tuned. All right. We are now down to the final, what is this, 44 minutes of this event. I was at a partnership panel, which is why I haven't really been active with it, with this event rather, but let's go ahead and check this out. Cause we did complete all the time research. We're gonna start off with, let's get the rain guru. Nah, yeah, let's get the rain guru out the way. So let's go ahead and claim all that. There's a lot of stuff that we had to go through. So here's one that's not shiny. We're going to quick catch all of these and oh dude that's persimmon my bad i did not want to do that one that was an accident okay so we're gonna again go through the rangaroos and then we're gonna switch it up and go to the persimmons so let's start off here and that's not shiny now again i'm not concerned with the shiny rangaroo because i already got that i'm not concerned with this at all so the main focus here is this persimmon oh i need to be cautious about the uh xls and stuff like that even though I more than likely would not get first place in the showcases with all these people going, with all these people here playing Pokemon Go. So I doubt that's going to happen. All right, so let's see. Next up on the list is this one right here, which is not shiny. I feel like I had that CP already. All right, let's move on though. Scroll down here. Oh my God, that's a lot. There's a lot. I think it's 15. Now that I think about it, I think it's 15. Oh, 10, 50? That one may be a hundo. Let me see. First of all, let's switch this over here. Let's see what the IVs are on this one. That's a hundo. I knew it. We got a hundo get a rangaroo. Too bad that one was not the shiny. I knew it. As soon as I saw it, I'm like, yo, that's kind of high for a CP. But we got a hundo a rangaroo from this event, which is crazy. Here's another one. Not shiny. 
25 CP less than obviously the Hundo, but we're gonna keep it moving. And let's see, I, I have no clue where I'm at with this count. 10, 21, I mean with 15 each? Like you have to get something, a Hundo, a Shiny, you have to get something, and we did get a Hundo so far, and we got a lot to go. Oh, but there it is, there's the Shiny right there. 1026 CP, we know the IVs are bland with this one, because the Hundo is 1050. So, we got a Shiny Ranger rule, so we got two Shinies from this event, and, well, no, I ain't gonna say two Shinies from San Diego, because we did hatch that Shiny Jangma O. That was off camera, though. So yeah, we got a Shiny, and I, I smell hot dogs. And I don't recall them serving hot dogs yet. Anywho, back to back shinies. Let's go. Yo, back to back shinies, 1030. And the IVs are better with this one. That's crazy. Back to back shinies at TritzCon. That's what's up. You cannot make this stuff up. That is amazing. And this one got 15 attack, even though it don't mean much. But that one do have 15 attack. So let me see. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. And then the seven one down here. So let's go ahead and check this one. Okay, no back to back to backs. Oh my gosh, this may be the worst one. 999 CP? That might be the worst one. Let me double check that one real quick. What the IVs on this one? Almost, almost, almost. Okay, so continuing on. That's crazy though, back to back shine. And there's another shiny. We got three of these things now, 1014 CP. That's what's up. Again, the IVs are crap, but that's fine. Cause we got our third shiny. So that's basically three shinies in the last four checks. That's what that was. And you are kicking out. Why are you kicking out? Why are you kicking out? You should not be kicking out. Let's go ahead and capture that great throw. Hopefully this is a great catch. And then we can move on to the other checks, bars. And let's see what we got. Yup, that is the catch. I can't believe that though. Three shinies within the last four checks. That is unbelievable. So let's move on. We got about like five more to do. And this one is not a shiny. 1024 CP. I like that pose. You were thinking like, hmm. <laughs> All right, let me see. We got four more to do. That one's not shiny. 1034 CP. We're gonna quick catch that and then move on to the next one, which is right here. And this one is another one that's not shiny and another one that have crappy IVs. That one 1015, we got two more to go. And the next one right here is another one not shiny, slightly better IVs, but still not where we want it. Not where we want it. All right, so here we go. We're gonna claim this right here. So we're gonna get 1,000 dust, 2,500 XP, and a counter with a shiny Oranguru. Another shiny Oranguru. That's what I'm talking about. I think we got four just from these checks alone. We got four from these checks right here. That is crazy, that is unbelievable. So yes, we doing it big, and that's it with the Rangaroos. Oh my goodness, okay. So there you go, another 15 attacker. So we got about like 39 minutes before this event ends. We're gonna explore more TwitchCon, and then we got to open up the rewards for the Persimians. Stay tuned. So we got 16 minutes left before this event is over. Now let's do this check right here since I completed this real quick. This is a Rangaru and not a Shiny. So we're gonna go ahead and quick catch that real quick. Now, for the main event, the main check is the Persimian. So again, we got fifth, well technically 14 because I checked one by accident. So let's go ahead and get this out the way real quick. Persimian, not Shiny. Now remember, we did get a Shiny Earlier today, during the Twitch Rivals event, where I was just sitting down relaxing and watching that going down for a bit. So, we already got one shiny, and we pretty much done. But let's see if we get some more. I mean, we was like going crazy with the Orangaroo shinies. So we have to get a shiny Persimian from this batch right here. So, so far, no set luck after three checks. We got more to go. That one's not shiny. And I noticed I did get a trail of 80 which is right here, and I didn't catch that last one. Dang, that's not a hundo. Okay, that's fine. No problems at all. This, however, the fact I didn't capture this is a problem. So let's go ahead. Okay, cool, we got that down packed. Let's check the next one. And this one is, oh, we got another shiny. Let's go, Trub 86. This one is much better than the Trub 80. 
Oh my goodness. So we got a second shiny Passimian. That's what I'm talking about. I love Research Day events because the shinies are pretty much guaranteed. They are pretty much guaranteed. Look at this, this is a 91% right here. I really, really like that. I really, really like that. All right, can we get back-to-back -back shinies like with the Rangaroo? No, not this time. 1282, so I'm gonna take a raw guess to say that the Hundo's like 1300 CP, I'm guessing, I don't know. And apparently this one did not get caught. Boo hisses. So we're gonna go ahead, use a Raz on it. And then we're going to, bro, will you stop with the shoulder tackle and get in the ball and stay in the ball? Thank you. All right, next up is this. Now the shiny. 1277, IVs are terrible. Excellent throw. Yep, that was an excellent catch. We got some rays to go. Bars, shiny, no. 1281, again, not the hundo, cause the highest one I got, I believe is a 1286. How about you, are you shiny? No, you're not shiny. And this one is crappy. This one might be the worst one out of the bunch. I could be wrong on that. All right, let's see. How many we got? One. Oh, well, we're checking the bottom one right here. Not shiny. 1262 CP. Not shiny, like I said. Great throw. Great catch. That was not a catch. That was lame. Stay in the ball, please. So let's go ahead, get this catch. This thing is being crazy reckless right now. All right, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six more. Shiny? No, oh my gosh, the luck with the Rangaroo was much better than this one. I should have probably went with this one first. This is crazy. All right, we got a great throw. Got the catch. We got five more to go. Shiny, come on. No, no shiny. 12.51 CP again. And we're gonna go ahead, move on to the next one. And we got four more. Is this the shiny? No, oh my God. 12.97, 12.97. We have to check the IVs on that one. 12.97, let's see what the IVs are on this one. Oh, that's a 98. That's a 98. So it may be 1300. It may be 1300, like I said. So let's see it, what this is. That one is not a shiny, 1253 CP. And we're going to go ahead and do that. And then we got this one right here. Oh, my collection's full. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. My collection is full. My collection is indeed full. We can trash some of these real quick. So we're gonna get that out the way. That's not shiny, 1256 CP. Ooh, his, his. There we go with that. And then we have one more to do, which is right here. So we're gonna say, let's see, 1,000 dust, 2,500 XP, and then counter it. Another Pacimia that's not shiny, 1281 CP. Boo, his, his. So there you go with that. We're done with all of that. We got two more checks to do. Where are they? Another Pacimia, not shiny, 1241 CP. And then we got one more to check. Are you shiny? Is a Rangaroo not shiny? So we probably gonna wrap it up from this point. So I'm gonna give you my final thoughts. So yeah, stay tuned. Matter of fact, we're going this way. You're coming along. So that's gonna do it for this crazy adventure of Pokemon Go. So I made it back to my spot where I'm gonna be sleeping for the night or so. So let's take a look and see what we've been through all weekend long. Now, the Shinies didn't really come in until this was hatched. The Shiny JMO, which is my second one. I need one more Shiny JMO to complete that family. This one got 15 I, uh, attack rider and the IVs are like 87, maybe 85. But the 15 attack, that could be worth something. Then we got today's action. The shiny Persimian, right here. So that's what's up. Then we got the Orangaroo, back-to-back Orangaroos. And then the third one out of four pools. And then the last one right there. And then of course, this shiny Persimian, that have really good IVs for, I guess, rating. Cause that was like a 91, if memory says it correctly. So basically, seven shinies doing TwitchCon, that ain't bad. That really, really ain't bad. So, for those of you who don't know, this is actually my very first TwitchCon. So, I would be perfectly honest with you guys when I say the following. I had low expectations for TwitchCon, but after being here, it was phenomenal. Um, a lot of stuff to see, a lot of stuff to do, people all over the place, content creators, streamers all over the place. So, there's opportunities here to work with brands, 
work with other content creators, gain some knowledge, possibly join some guilds, join some squads, meetups. And there's a lot to do at TwitchCon. So if you are a streamer, I would say go to at least one TwitchCon just for the fun and for networking and getting business done. So very phenomenal trip. If I do say so myself, as the light just went off behind me, which is interesting. So there you go with that. I don't know about Wednesday's video. I would still be in San Francisco on Monday and Tuesday. Oh no, all the lights just went out on me. But um, there we go. I got the wrong light on. I need the light in front of me to come back on. Hold up. If I were to walk forward, there we go. There we go, that's what we want. So that part of me, I need to wrap this up. So again, go to at least one TwitchCon. I'm gonna try to come back next year. We'll see what happens. I'm not gonna make any promises, but we'll see what happens next year. And then Wednesday's video, that's the thing. I'll be on a flight, multiple flights. I won't be back home until like 7 p.m. my time. So I don't know when or if, if I'll have Wednesday's video up, which would be like extra stuff from me in San Diego. So. Because it's involved us going to the zoo on Tuesday. So, hope that I can bring that to you guys. But then Wednesday, I have an early flight. So, I'm not sure if that video would be out on Wednesday. If not, it would definitely be out on Friday. And actually, there may be another video coming out on Tuesday. I need to check my notes. But there may be a video coming out on Tuesday. So, if you reach this part of the video, leave in the comment section below. Purple site. If you reach this part of the video, leave in the comment section purple site. And at the very end, you should see two cards. One of them would be the last video that I put out. The other one would be something that YouTube recommends. And I'm going to call it a wrap. And this Thursday, I will be back live streaming on the purple website. So I will go full in depth about TwitchCon, some of the funny moments that happened, some of the stuff I have received while I was at TwitchCon. So you do not want to miss that at all. So we're going to be talking about TwitchCon while doing some Scarlet Invited Raids. I know a new Raid boss is out. So we're going to be messing with that as there's a Machop here that's not shiny. So y'all don't need to see that. I'm going to call it a wrap now. So with all that said, y'all know who this is. This is my new Jay Gatsby, aka new Stephen A. Smith. Saying peace out, y'all. And I'll see y'all next time as I'm crawling on the stairs. Take care, y'all. Subscribe. <laughs> Thanks, man. Right. Right. After you subscribe to the channel, make sure you click the bell icon so you never miss a new video or a live stream ever again. Thanks, guys. Lewis the trainer, articulating paint With my tongue, I done things that people said I can't yeah. Now they rank them with the elite But it's for the people and victory is part of defeat Cause when you get back on your feet, then you try again Learn from mistakes, show them that I got what it takes And I'm dying to win, okay. I'ma hit and move away 